Welcome to my channel. The FA Cup gods have seen it fit to pair Manchester United and Liverpool in the quarterfinal again for a 15th season running. It will be either Liverpool or Manchester United with Wembley as the destination for an FA Cup semi-final during April 2024. For Eric Ten Hag, he will be aiming for a second trophy in his tenure with Manchester United and Liverpool will continue to fight for a quadruple this season. Manchester United defeated Liverpool a couple of seasons with the Bruno Fernandes magical goal and in the last season again Manchester United defeated Liverpool which was a catalyst for an unbeaten rest of the season catapulting them to a third place finish in the Premier League. Manchester United will have to get something similar or more than that if they have to get past this Liverpool side in the FA Cup tie today at Old Trafford. Manchester United have a strong record in knocking out Liverpool most number of times, but today's game is very different. Teams, two changes for Manchester United with the return of Aaron Van Bissaka coming in the back four after two months layoff along with uh, Varane, Lindelof and Diego Dallo. With Onana on the goal, McTominay coming in place of Casemiro is out with a muscle injury. He joins Mainu in the midfield too with uh, Rashford, Bruno Fernandes and Garnacho as the front three in the midfield. Hoyland returns to lead the team as a striker from his injury. The Danish striker has scored eight times in his last eight games before the injury ruled him out for the last four games. On the bench today, we've got Mason Mount who makes a return. We should see him with some play today later. Liverpool also have named a very strong side for this FA Cup tie, same as they did for the Europa Cup tie with the Sparta. With Kelleher on the goal, Robertson returns to the starting 11 with Van Dijk, Kwanza and Gomez as the back four. Sabuslai, the strong and energetic Japanese Endo along with the Argentinian McAllister is in the midfield three. The pesky and the tricky Colombian Diaz, Mo Salah, who has the great scoring goals against uh, Manchester United and Nunes as the strong front three. They definitely have a great pace up front there for Liverpool. First half. A first goal will be key in this fixture like this. Some good touches there from the Manchester United players there. Mainu combining very well with Bruno and Van Basaka and the shot on the goal was very lame there. No danger for Liverpool at all there. Manchester United looking for a very strong start at Old Trafford. Well, it was a good chance there for Van Basaka. A great run from Mainu to start the move from the midfield. Again, Manchester United applying great pressure. Another great move this time again from midfield with Ganacho finding Rashford and a shot is palmed away by the goalkeeper Kelleher. A really good save there from the Liverpool goalkeeper. 9,000 Liverpool fans are allowed at the quarterfinals today at Old Trafford due to the allocation for the FA Cup and they are trying their best with their voice. A good long ball again from Nunes coming there, finding Salah, his volley just missing the post. So you can never side out the Liverpool team here. Rashford holding the ball very well up there. His through ball for Ganacho is shot is safe there, but the rebound is bundled into the goal by Scott McTominay. It is Manchester United 1, Liverpool 0. Manchester United half the lead in the FA Cup quarterfinals at Old Trafford. McTominay, he has scored few goals this season. This is another pivotal one uh, in his bag for Manchester United. His desire there to reach the box, take the rebound and put it out behind Kelleher. Manchester United are in the front foot here. Another good chance coming there for Manchester United. This time, a great block from Andy Robertson there. It's a great start again for Manchester United. They have Liverpool in the back four for the first time. Liverpool mid field making some good passes there Andy Robertson on the left making some good crosses putting Manchester United defense under tremendous pressure there they're very dangerous when they have the wingers running with the ball Manchester United need to be careful there not to allow them more space 
again another great piece of skill there from Kobe Mainu he gets past three Liverpool players there he finds Rashford a very nice pull ball back to Scott McTominay and a shot is saved there by Kelleher it should have been another goal for Manchester United a very good opportunity goes a begging there Diaz there making a strong run for Liverpool he gets Onana to make another good save there second time Onana is making a save from Diaz he seems to be having a good run on the left there Ganacho needs to come up with him and then try to catch up with him there Endo's goal is ruled out due to the offside by VAR. It is still Manchester United 1 and Liverpool 0. Quenza makes a dashing run into the penalty area. He finds Nunes. He pulls back and McAllister shots, takes a deflection. He beats Andre Orana. It's Manchester United 1, Liverpool 1 in the FA Cup quarterfinals at Old Trafford. Well, four minutes at a time, Manchester United again making few more mistakes there. They were looking with confidence in the first 35 minutes of the game, but the last 10 minutes or so, it's been Liverpool dominating the game with a lot of passes, a lot of movements and a lot of creativity in there. Van Basaka finds Bruno, he's bundled down, referee indicated that it was one fairly Darwin uh, Lewis Diaz finds Darwin Nunes. His shot is again saved by Onana, but Mo Salah smashes the ball into the goal for Liverpool's second of the night. Right at the stroke of half time, the game has been turned from being one goal down. Liverpool now lead 2 1 at Old Trafford. Two goals in the space of three minutes. Manchester United are shell shocked. Old Trafford is shell shocked. Deep into the extra time, VAR checked goal stands. It's Manchester United 1, Liverpool 2. Refereeing has been inconsistent in the first half. Something for officials to take note of. Manchester United will definitely be disappointed. Eric Tan Hag will be very disappointed here. Old Trafford will not be happy as this goal was scored from what looked like a foul on Bruno. VAR check but not given, but the goal stands there. Halftime score does not reflect the balance of the play at all. First 35 minutes, it was all Manchester United. They took the lead, could have got two or three more. Well, Liverpool did have chances. They got one goal back with McAllister. Second goal was contentious, but they are leading 1-2 at half time. Manchester United missed chances, has come back to haunt them again at the end of first half. It is Manchester United 1, Liverpool 2 in the FA Cup quarterfinals at Old Trafford. Second half, Manchester United start brightly again. The first 10 minutes crucial for Manchester United here. They're down 1-2 in this game. Manchester United pressing on again. A good move coming from the midfield with Mainu finding Rashford and Bruno makes his run into the box. He's just shy of the goal. A good move there from Manchester United. It's drama at both the ends again. Liverpool making a quick counter-attack. Nunes' shot is very well off the target. Ganacho again seems to be brought down there, but the referee doesn't seem to. He let the play continue. Sabusalai gets a shot again, saved by Onana. There is more pressure from Liverpool. They seem to be getting more confident as we may progress in the second half. Liverpool are finding more good touches, more good passes. They look comfortable. They're finding it easier to make passes and finding players at ease. They are on the ascendance as a team. Liverpool have a free kick in a very dangerous area there. McAllister's shot is well over the goal. No danger for Manchester United and Onana's goal. Liverpool has played a game on Thursday. They're back to playing an FA Cup game, so we should see Klopp making changes soon with fatigue kicking into the Liverpool players. Liverpool are finding a lot of space. They are able to make a lot of good passes. Sabusalai, Endo, McAllister able to control the midfield more in the second half than what they did in the first half. This time, Darwin Nunes with a good shot there. Onana called in again with a good save on his left side this time. 
Manchester United need to find a way back into the FA Cup. Liverpool are on top now. They lead 2-1. Manchester United need to get the second goal, force this game into an extra time. Liverpool enjoying a lot of ball possession there. They're relishing it. Manchester United will just need to get that one moment to score a goal. They need to find that. They need to push players forward, press Liverpool and get that one crucial goal and get back on level terms. Manchester United are making a couple of changes. Hoyland replaced by Anthony when Basaka comes off with Harry Maguire. Liverpool are also making changes. Busalai coming off for Harvey Elliott there. It looks like Liverpool have one hand on the Wembley ticket for the FA Cup tie semi-finals already, with Manchester United having something more than 20 minutes to change it in their favour at Old Trafford today. Anthony takes a shot just wide of the goal. He's playing on the right. He's been good uh, their last season, but not so this uh, season yet. He's still yet to take off this season. Minus replaced there by Eriksson, the midfield maestro. He slots in the midfield directly there. Manchester United are under pressure. They did very well in the first half. Liverpool playing the better in the second half. They're having more of the ball. They're looking very dangerous in the second half. And Manchester United are not out yet. Ahmad comes on there for Rafael Varane. Eric Tan Hag is throwing his hat out there. Taking a gamble, takes out a defender for an attacker. A good move this time on the right for Manchester United. Garnacher's shot is blocked. Anthony gets a shot with his right feet. He beats Kelleher, all ends up there. A goal for Manchester United and he has got it. Manchester United are level. Huge ruckus in the Old Trafford. This FA Cup game is not done yet. It is Manchester United 2, Liverpool 2. Anthony from the bench has only one job to do to get a goal and he gets it to perfection there with this not favor uh, uh, left foot but with this right foot. A shot is buried in the bottom right corner of the goal. Eriksen again with an excellent ball this time over the uh, top. He finds Marcus Rashford and he beats Kelleher. His shot is just wide off the, off the post. What an opportunity there to close the game, a chance to wrap the game up for Manchester United with Rashford's goal right before the final whistle of the FA Cup uh, quarterfinals there. The second half of the FA Cup quarterfinal belonged to Liverpool there, but Anthony's goal brought Manchester United back to 2 takes his game to extra time, the hope for silverware goes on. After regulation time at Old Trafford, the FA Cup quarterfinal between Manchester United and Liverpool, it ends 2-2. Extra time first half, well, 30 more minutes to play. Extra time in the FA Cup quarterfinal, Manchester United last gasp, goal, pushed out this game to the extra time. Nobody in the Old Trafford has moved a bit. A good move again from Manchester United, starting with Eriksen. He's playing a deeper role, pushing up where needed in the midfield. He finds Anthony with a cracking ball. His left foot curler is just over the bar there. He almost got his second one for the game. Manchester United are definitely pushing up, putting more pressure in the midfield. Eric Tan Hag's substitution has worked to perfection and he's got more substitution to go again one more maybe we will get to see mason mount post his long injury layoff in some time onana on the goal has been excellent today his presence in the goal and saves his mayor today he's really been good he's been in commanding form in the goal for manchester united in the last few games quenza for liverpool is finding a lot of space on the right side, making those bullying runs into the penalty box. Manchester United need to be careful. This could lead to danger. Harvey Elliott again gets the ball, takes a shot. It takes a big deflection. It takes it away and beats Onana. All ends up there. 105th minute, Elliott with the third goal for Liverpool. It's Manchester United 2, Liverpool 3. Manchester United need to come back again from behind as we come towards the end of the first half extra time. 
so half time at extra time it's Harvey Elliott's shot that was deflected into the goal so it's Manchester United 2 Liverpool 3 all the 9,000 Liverpool fans are enjoying that's the game of football Manchester United need to come back again strong in the second 15 minutes of the extra time of this tie <coughs> Mason Mount has come on for Manchester United in place of uh, Lindelof, another offensive player in the field now. Manchester United have only three defensive players on now, Bruno and Eriksen playing in the Manchester shift defence as well. Manchester United pressing again, looking for that crucial equaliser. Ahmad again makes a ta tackle in the midfield, he finds McTominay who finds Rashford with a very good ball. His first time shot beats Kelleher, all ends up in the bottom left corner. It's Manchester United third goal there. Old Trafford Arabs, Marcus Rashford's Man Manchester United savior today. His game uh, has everything. This game has got everything we wanted. Goals, drama, it's three, three. Manchester United three and Liverpool three goals now. Well, this has been a scintillating FA Cup quarterfinals at the Theatre of Dreams, a one to remember and talked about for a very long time to come. The noise level at Old Trafford is just incredible. Even at this late stage, second half of the extra time, it's not often we get to experience uh, such games there in uh, Old Trafford. Another good move there coming from Manchester United. Ericsson finds Rashford with an excellent ball to find McTominay again. His shot is just wide off the call there. Kelleher is all ends beaten there. Ahmad again tackles Elliot. He finds Ganacho and the counter attack is on. He finds Ahmad back again into the penalty area and he manages to beat Kelleher into the left bottom corner. Manchester United have won it. Ahmad with a goal three years since his last Manchester United goal, right at the end of the extra time. Manchester United are heading back to Wembley for the FA Cup semi-final tie. Manchester United did to Liverpool what Liverpool does to all other teams. Break up and counter-attack with pace. At this stage of the game, the pace shown by the front three, Ganacho, Ahmad and Rashford is immense. Their work ethic for the whole team is excellent to watch. This is sensational and Ahmad gets a sent off again with the celebration and the second yellow car. The last two minutes, Manchester United are down to 10 players whistles all around Old Trafford. 124th minute of the game. Anything we'll do now for Manchester United and that's the final whistle into the FA Cup semi-final tie and a ticket to Wembley. An epic FA Cup quarterfinals at Old Trafford between Manchester United and Liverpool. Early lead there for Manchester United. Liverpool coming back twice, taking the lead twice. Manchester United coming back with Anthony's goal there with Leveller and an extra time goal from Elliot. Equalizer coming from Rashford to make it 3 3. And the final blow from Ahmad Diallo. It's ended. Manchester United 4, Liverpool 3. An incredible finish at Old Trafford in this FA Cup quarter final tie between Manchester United and Liverpool. Well, that's it from my side. Please provide a comment. Subscribe to my channel for more such reviews. Until next time, take care.